connectivity and safety lie at the heart of industrial IoT. How can today's manufacturers bridge the gap between today's possibilities and tomorrow's technology? Welcome to Factory Tomorrow. Presented by DigiKey. Powered by Siemens, Banner Engineering, and SupplyFrame. In this episode, we explore how companies like DigiKey and its partners are making Industry 4.0 more accessible, enabling factories at any stage of development to implement critical technology. At DigiKey, we partner with the greatest suppliers of automation and control products in the world. Today, we're at Banner Engineering, where we're showcasing the technologies that are enabling the factory of tomorrow. Banner Engineering's ever-growing product line of connected IIoT products enables smart manufacturing across various industries. On the production floor, we discover how these technologies are transforming the manufacturing landscape. Companies are starting to realize that access to critical data for their organizations is not just a, a nice to have anymore, it's a necessity to stay competitive in this landscape. You know, a failed motor could be a maintenance manager's worst nightmare. One of the questions I often like to ask is, what assets, if they were to fail in your facility, would be catastrophic to your production? And how do you currently monitor those assets? And once you start pulling in the data, you gain confidence in the data, you start to scale up. Sometimes it could be simple as adding a, a vibration sensor to a motor. So some issues that could arise with injection molding, downtime events if a motor was to fail, there could be quality issues if temperature and humidity goes too high, a surface defects on an injection molded part. It takes virtually an hour to have a full condition monitoring set up in place where we could access the vibration data, things like power monitoring, so we could see current transformers monitoring certain assets within the injection molding machine itself, as well as temperature. So we could send this data to Banner CDS, to a PLC, to another cloud platform very easily. One of the things that's really powerful about Banner's technology is that we're brand agnostic. So we have interoperability with all these different sensors, whether it's an IO link sensor, an analog sensor, a discrete sensor, we can start pulling in data from all these different sources. The ability to retrofit existing legacy machines with sensors, with condition monitoring technology, without disrupting their existing control system. The average age of manufacturing assets in the United States is about 20 years old. And so giving access to our customers the ability to extract data from what we call those data islands, essentially, where the data is previously locked in, we can now give them access to that data so they can make those data-driven decisions. You own your data, so you get to send it where it needs to go. The idea of going to an IoT network, implementing condition monitoring and predictive maintenance, it's a daunting idea when you're starting from scratch. It doesn't have to be this ginormous initiative where we retrofit an entire factory all in a couple months' time. We can start small, get people comfortable, get them familiar with the solution, give them time to see the ROI and the value, and then build off of that and scale over time. We're losing a lot of tribal knowledge to people retiring out of the industry. The people that could just walk by a machine and put their hand on it and know exactly what was wrong, right? That is less and less of a skill that we're going to have in the future and I think people are going to really start relying on the IoT solutions for machine insights and the predictive maintenance. Safety is all about sensing the presence of humans in areas where they might not need to be or where they might be in a dangerous predicament. Humans and robots might be closer to each other than ever before and we need to predict the movement of that human and know where the robot is at all times and slow that robot down before a human can ever get hurt. This is kind of our sandbox. We get to build a safer factory here and then say, hey, we did it here and here's our KPIs and here's how we did it better. Let's give it a shot at your factory. Our safe touch button ensures that you have to hit both buttons at the right time in order for the station to run. If you try to trick it and do one after the other, it won't let it run. The SDBs have self-checking circuitry, they're safety rated, and it just keeps your hands out of the dangerous part of the process. The vision camera is inspecting whether or not the markings are proper on the light curtain. That's one of our products. By the time my hand breaks the beam and is sensed, the machine has to shut down before my hand can actually make it to a dangerous process. It's called the safety distance. 
An emergency stop is not your first line of defense. It's if all else fails, it's your reaction device. So we have our e-stops. We also have our touch buttons. This box is blocking some of the beams on the light curtain. You can actually tell the light curtain, ignore those beams during the process. So we have some of our relays and then we have our safety controller. We're actually gonna be upgrading our safety controller to one of our new versions that's network accessible. If I'm sitting at my office at corporate, and I want to see what's going on with the machine, I can just remote log into it. I can change a configuration. I can really easily view what's going on safety-wise. Through its close relationships with leading suppliers, DigiKey makes industrial IoT and automation solutions more accessible than ever. Being an engineer, an electrical engineer, DigiKey has been ubiquitous in my world. When you order just a simple capacitor, their filtering system, I mean, I've tried a lot of other electronic shops online and DigiKey's system is the easiest one to use by far. In my personal world, if I send someone to go buy some electronic components, I say, go to DigiKey first, plain and simple. DigiKey is a phenomenal partner for us, growing very rapidly, right? They're scaling alongside Banner, which is great to see, it's been really fun. But going up there and seeing the automation that they have implemented within their facility was remarkable. I mean, they're just a machine. They, they really have it figured out from the logistics side. They're able to pump out product very quickly, very efficiently with minimal errors. So I actually think we as Banner have a lot to learn from DigiKey about automation and operations and, and how to make that process flawless. As manufacturing continues to evolve, companies need to seek out efficient ways to embrace transformative industrial IoT solutions. Future factories look different from one industry to another, but connectivity and safety are the common denominators for factory tomorrow.